Yeah, John Abbott. Hey, John. Although not discussed, the myriad of problems had originally with Ubuntu One have been completely cleared. The uploads now are quick and complete. It's Great. so cool to be able to drag and drop into the Ubuntu One folder and seconds later see the green check marks were synchronized. Considering this service is free to everyone using Ubuntu, I see it as a great service. And if you need larger stores, then they can accommodate you for a fee. I'm still waiting on my Pogo Plug 2 to arrive. Mm. Uh, it's on the so delivery truck. One. And nice. then all of this becomes more or less mute. I think this was really moot. Right, right. Uh, my, son is in, my son in Kentucky also has a new Pogo Plug 2. Nice. And we've committed space on each other's drives for critical backups. We each will have two TB attached, so there's plenty of room. Looking forward to tonight's show. Well, hi, John. <laughs> hey, John. How are you getting a Pogo Plug 2 before I am? I'm supposed to be at the top of the list. I think instead of few clues, <laughs> he should be many clues. I think that's a really cool... Or got a clue. Yeah, oh, no, he knows what he's doing. He knows what he's doing. <laughs> and I think that you bring up a really great way to use your Pogo Plug 2, and that is to do bandwidth sharing with a family member. You know, buy them one for Christmas, wink, wink, and say, here, you got to plug this in and set it up, but then you're using it for off-site backup. Well, hey, that's, you know, a $99 investment or whatever. You know, it's not expensive, 120 or something like that. So, you know, great way to use it. PogoPlug uh, 2, for those of you who aren't familiar with it, PogoPlug.com, it is a cloud storage device that allows you to plug in a USB hard drive and be able to uh, access it from anywhere in the world as a mapped drive from Windows, Linux, or Mac. Very cool device, and I love what you're doing with it there, John. Yeah. Sharing uh, off-site backup with your son. 